Hey guys, welcome back to the Margo YouTube channel. For many years now, I've been testing, I've been designing and manufacturing LED grow lights. And as part of um, the process, I've been using a spectra radiometer to test the spectrum output of any devices that I'm testing or, or designing. And a key part of understanding what you're doing is understanding the spectrum of the light source and how it may affect your plants. I've been using uh, are testing recently the new sensor spectra radiometer, uh, the MS100 by Apogee. Apogee Instruments are a very renowned and reputable company from Utah in the US, led by Dr. Bruce Bugby. Again, a very well-known and respected uh, figure in horticultural science. Apogee Instruments produce a lot of instrumentation for agriculture and horticulture. This device is exceptional, I have to say. Very nice little neat piece of kit and uh, very, very easy to use. It's got a little display screen here, as you can see here. I just did a little test of um, the lights behind me. So you can get a spectrum readout. Um, the sensor is on the back here, protected with a slide. And uh, you've got a memory card and a USB connection. To take a reading, you just simply hold it under the light source and hold the button in and uh, it takes a full reading and uh, get a beeping sound and there you can see the spectrum output. It measures from 380 nanometers to 780 nanometers. So all of the wavelengths of light that plant use from UVA all the way up to far red. Uh, it measures up from zero up to three and a half thousand uh, micromoles per meter square per second. So you can use it as a um, quantum sensor as well. Not only do you get the display here, it will input that uh, data into your, your memory card and you take that memory card out or you can just connect it directly onto your PC uh, with the USB cable, and download um, the recordings that you've taken, the measurements that you've taken and then use the free Apogee Insight software to view that spectrum output. And there's lots of interesting things you can do in the software, looking at both the energy and the photon count at different wavelengths, uh, in different bands of wavelengths. And also you can see lots of different um, characteristics of the light with regard to human vision, so photography. Uh, so you can measure CCT, uh, CRI, all of those kind of things. So it's an all-rounder device, really. Uh, very reasonably priced, um, just under $2,000, which is very good value for money for uh, this device with its level of accuracy and, um, and also the, uh, the flexibility and the usability of the software. So I found it to be outstanding, and it's the one that I will be using from now on to, uh, to test all my grow lights with. So um, yeah, happy to recommend. Links are in the description below. Um, please check it out if you're interested in a spectroradiometer. Take care.